Now, aviation experts have commended the pilot of the Nigerian Air Force plane that crashed on Saturday, even in his grave, for being considerate in avoiding residential or built-up areas. According to them, the casualties would have been more beyond the seven-man crew that perished with the aircraft. Plus TV, Africa's correspondent, Destiny Momo, has more for us. Still a moment of grief for the Nigerian military, particularly the Air Force, as seven officers were confirmed dead on the crashed NAF Beechcraft King Air B-350I. The crash took place in Basa, which is a community that is few kilometers away from the Namdi Azikiwe Airport, Abuja. Air Vice Marshal Femi Gbalibo during Plus TV Africa Breakfast show argues that the pilot was very considerate to reduce the carnages due to his expertise. You also have a lot of built-up areas around the airport in Abuja, estates and so on. And uh, part of the information I have is that the pilot elected not to crash into one of the built-up areas. It's a situation where um, the only place he could go safely was to go back to the airport to land. Of course, um, there are cases where you could try a crash landing with an aircraft that is um, not moving too fast. And if there was some relatively clear area without trees, Abuja has some of those areas at the airport. He also identified some technical hiccups that could have been avoided while expressing confidence that the black box will reveal further curses. Uh, mind you, the aircraft itself has uh, a black box, which is a flight recorder that records every engine parameters from engine start to, to, to the crash itself. It, in, it records the voice, I mean, you have a voice cockpit recorder that will record all the uh, voice exchanges in the cockpit. All these things will give a clear indication of what has happened. For others, the crash should not create panic for air travelers, explaining that the aviation authorities are on top of their game in the recent time. Nigeria is regulated by International Civil Aviation Organization, or ICAO. Uh, Nigeria is part of the global community when it comes to aviation and air safety. With what we have, we can conveniently say that the, uh, that the country's airspace is very, very, very safe. You recall the days uh, when we used to have a series of air crashes in Nigeria? Um, that is gone. In, I mean, in commercial aviation, that's no longer the case today. The chief of the air staff, Air Vice Marshal Oladayo Amau, has instituted an investigative panel to determine the remote and immediate cause of the crash. Destiny Momo for Plus TV Africa. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.